Hello everybody. Today we are going to start a new chapter. Lesson 14. The Deccan Plateau. Through this chapter you will learn about the location of Deccan Plateau, divisions of it, importance of this plateau and of course the climate of Deccan Plateau. But firstly, we should know about the term plateau. What does it mean? A plateau, an area of flat land which is higher than the land around it as you can see in this pic is known as plateau. It is also called table land. The Deccan Plateau, the great plateau of India is also known as the Deccan Plateau. Location of Deccan Plateau Where it lies? It lies towards the, This is the Deccan Plateau. It lies towards the south of Great Plains. This area, this belt is of the plains. So the south of this Great Plain is the Deccan Plateau or in the southern peninsula of India. Peninsula has Bay of Bengal towards its east and the Arabian Sea lies on the west side of it. And the, finally this Indian Ocean is towards the south of it as you can see through this map. Division of the Peninsular Plateau The river Narmada divides the plateau region into two parts. The central highland in the north that is towards the top and the Deccan Plateau in the south. The central highland include the Malwa Plateau in the central India and the Chota Nagpur Plateau in the east. Rivers of the Deccan Plateau River Chambal, Betwa and Son originate in the central highland and flow northwards and finally join Ganga and Yamuna rivers. The Narmada and Tapi rivers begin in the Vindhya's hills and flow westward and merge into Arabian Sea as you can see the position of these. Hills found in the Western Ghats. It has a long range of hills which includes Nilgiri Hills, Anamala Hills and Cardamom Hills. Hills of Deccan Plateau Malwa Plateau is bounded by Aravali Hills in north, west and Vindhyas in the south. It has black soil which is very good for growing cotton and oil seeds. To make now, the top to understand it, let's see this through the short video. What topic more clear? Let's take an aerial view of the peninsula plateau. Peninsula is a triangular shaped landmass jutting means beyond the surface into the sea. As explained, River Narmada divides the peninsular plateau in two parts. North of the River Narmada is the central highland and south of the River Narmada is the Deccan Plateau. Deccan Plateau is bounded by the Eastern Ghats on the east and Western Ghats on the west side. Ghats are a long range of hills. If we go closer, we observe how exactly a plateau looks like. It is a flat at the top and raised above the remaining surrounding land. That is why it is known as table land. Thus, we have seen an overview of the peninsula plateau including the central highland, river Namura, Deccan plateau, eastern and western ghats. The rivers of the south are fed by rain. They are flooded with water 
during and after the rainy season. If water is in more amount, then flood come there. Most rivers such as the Godavari, Mahanadi, Krishna and Kaveri rise in the west and flow into the Bay of Bengal. Now, importance of Deccan Plateau. As we discussed earlier, black and red color soil is mainly found in the Deccan Plateau. So, black soil is good for the cultivation of cotton and oil seeds, while red soil is suitable for the groundnut, sugar cane and millet. This is the production of cotton. The Chota Nagpur Plateau has rich deposits of coal, iron ore, manganese, bauxite, mica and other minerals. So we can see that number of minerals are available in that Chota Nagpur Plateau. We get wood, fruits and medicines from the thick forest which are available in the Deccan Plateau. The hilly areas have large plantation of tea, coffee, cinnamon and pepper. Now coming to the last topic of it, climate of the Deccan Plateau. The climate of this plateau is moderate, pleasant. Moderate means neither too hot, very hot in the summer, nor too cold in the winter. It has average rainfall, particularly in the monsoon months when the rain comes uh, from June to September. So you can see the result of the moderate climate which is looking pleasant. Hope you enjoyed learning and understood this topic Deccan Plateau. Thank you.